Hi, Trevor here. I'm going to go over adding a Microsoft 365 account to the Windows Mail application. This is the built-in Windows Mail application that comes with Windows 10. I want to click on Accounts and then select Add Account. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to run through it first as a person might typically do. So I'm going to show the failure of Windows Mail connecting to Office 365 and then we'll do it where it actually connects. So I'm going to put in my email address. It'll look for the account settings. And then it's going to ask me for more information, more than your typical setup. And you can see here, it couldn't find the settings. So you can go ahead and try put in additional information that you would probably have from your system administrator. But this is just going to fail. And then it's going to ask me for more information again. Or I can put in the username, domain, server, and the account name. But we're just going to stop it right here. So what I want to do is select the Office 365 Exchange. But instead of putting my email address from the domain I have set up, and that I use for logging into 365. When you first set up your organization with Office 365 or Azure AD or a Microsoft type account, you get a on Microsoft domain. So in my case, it would be Trevor Ty at domain dot on Microsoft dot com. And that is actually what we're going to use to get mail to get our Office 365 email. So the actual format is your email, your email at your domain dot on Microsoft dot com. So when I put that in, it will find my settings. So you can see here, pass through, it's creating the account. And you can see it's uh, in your regular domain format, my first name, last name at domain.ca. So I go continue and it will add the account to mail. Now, typically you'll have to add the username and password, but I've already added it to this machine. So I didn't have to re-authenticate. And there is my email. I hope you found this tutorial useful.